Hey guys, this is John with 757 Woodworks, and today I'm going to show you how I made these slate tiles with the Ortor Laser Master Pro 2. So with that, let's jump over to the computer so I can show you the process. Okay, so first things first, we're going to go ahead and open up the internet browser. In my particular case, that's Google Chrome. Now I'm going to head over to Etsy to find the image that I want. You could also use Google or any other various image programs. Now, I like this home sweet home image right here. Now, the reason why I like this is because for the most part, it is pretty symmetrical, which is gonna burn well onto the square tile. So with that, I'm gonna go ahead and buy it now and we'll go ahead and download it and import it into Lightburn. Now Lightburn is super powerful. The first thing I'm gonna do is draw a 100 millimeter by 100 millimeter square and I'm gonna position that into the bottom corner of my grid. Now I'm just doing this for alignment purposes as it will help me a little later when I go to burn. Import the image into Lightburn. With this, we're gonna go ahead and resize this down to approximately 80 millimeters wide. This is going to give it enough space to fit onto the tile. And I'm gonna position that into the center of the square that I did before. Now, the next thing I like to do is check my settings. For my laser, being a five and a half watt output power, 4,000 at 75% works really well. Now, the next thing I do is I check the preview for each one of the fill styles and check for the time that it's going to take. Now, I find the fill all shape once and fill groups together typically have the same time Sometimes the fill shapes individually has less or more. And the last one that we want to check is under the advanced tab and that's flood fill. In this particular case, it saved about two and a half minutes off of the other three styles. So we're going to go ahead and go with that. All right, so now I'm here at my laser. I'm gonna go ahead and lower the Z axis down so that it is properly aligned with the tile and in focus. With the Ortor, you wanna just have the top of the bottom of the laser touching. Now we're about to fire the laser, so we wanna make sure we put the glasses on. And here I am resetting and homing the laser, allowing my computer to find it. Go ahead and hit the frame button and make sure that it does look right. From here, we're going to go ahead and move to the start and fire the laser. Now this burn took about nine minutes. This is 10 times speed. And so far it is looking really good. Now with the other fill styles, sometimes it'll just go left to right all the way up the tile. So the flood fill is just filling just the actual items, which is the reason why it's so much faster. Now that's not always the case though, so please check them. Okay, so with that, this burn is just about finished and I'm super happy with how it turned out. We'll go ahead and move the gantry up and zoom in on the tile so you can get a better view. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos like this one in the future, please consider subscribing. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.